Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. And now that we've done a few things around the world, I quickly want to look around the school a little bit more because there are quite a few extra rooms that we have not been to see. As you can see by all the exclamation marks. So let me try this. Just look around a bit. I don't know what this is in relation to everything else, but I want to know. Um, there might not be anything, it just might be rooms we've not been to before. Because now that's... No, that's still got an exclamation mark on it. I assume it's because I have to talk to the teacher. There we go. Ah, hello, hello! Have you gotten used to things here at the academy, Jeremy? Yes. That, that is that I have to leave. Great, glad you're to see you having fun. Oh, have you been using the Pokedex app? I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm the one who made it, you know. Every time someone using, uh, using the app catches a Pokemon, the data gets sent, th sent to me. It's really helping with my Pokemon research. So be sure to catch any new Pokemon you find and work on filling in your Pokedex. For your first goal, let's aim for, let's say, 30. Register 30 Pokemon in your, in your app. Let me know what, once you've done so. Okay. I see you've already registered 30 species of Pokemon to your, to the, to your Pokedex for me. Wow, so you caught this kind of Pokemon and this one? All the starter. This is the best. Ah, sorry about that. I got a little excited here, there. But I get the feeling that you're going to be a, a great help with my Pokemon research. Here, take this. Consider it my way of saying thanks. TM57 False Swipe. You sure are good at catching Pokemon, aren't you, Jeremy? For your next goal, let's aim for 100 species. Remember, when you find a Pokemon you're, you've never seen before, give a Pokeball a throw. Cool, so we can actually get rewards for checking out parts of the school that we've not checked out before. So I guess we should probably check some other ones, since there are many. <laughs> Very many. Also, the schoolyard is up in the tower, and I, it took me a while to actually realize this. The outside area is not outside. It's up, it's up in the sky, basically. Up in the tallest tower. Yeah, this is this is this is uh this yeah. This is crazy. This is that that's what this is. Crazy. Doesn't seem to be that much around here. And I can't ride Karate on in here. You've gotta be kidding me. That is unfair. Surely a big open area like this is con considered outside or something. And like I know I said it's inside, but it's, those look like open area. That seems open to me. It's outside. Osu, new kid. Have you come here out here to the schoolyard for some training? Yes. Aha! I knew I could see a fight, fighting spirit burning beyond those, uh, behind those eyes of yours. Why don't we do a bit of running together here to get to know each other a little bit, little, little better? Ready? Let's go. <laughs> he ran three laps around the schoolyard with Miss Den Dendra. Well, actually, you ran three, and she ran two. <laughs> Twelve. She ran many more, because one of us in the room just sits down all day. On a Pokemon. Phew, that really worked up a nice sweat. You've got a good pair of legs on you, new kid. A good bout of tr training sure does make a body hungry, doesn't it? I'll let you have one of my homemade sandwiches as my way of saying thanks for running with me today. Feed those muscles. Miss Dangerous sandwich was dry and had an odd smell. The taste left much to be desired. How was it? I hope it was tasty. Ah, uh, yeah, tasty. Sorry, I shouldn't have asked you that. <laughs> I'm athletic and all, but I don't know the first thing about making good food. As your honest reaction, just reminded me. Well, uh, see you later. Enjoy some, some s your sore muscles tomorrow. You you become you became slightly closer with Miss Tendra. Cool. <laughs> Hashtag worth it. 
I don't know if I need to be here anymore. Probably not. Probably not. Yeah, schoolyard's marked off now. Let's go to the nurse's office. Because after all that running, I probably died. To be honest. Also, the, the, the Pikachu and Eevee here is very, very nice. Gotta say. Hey there, come on in. Everyone's welcome in the nurse's office. What brings you here today? I don't see anything super wrong with you or your Pokemon. Wait, this is your first time here, isn't it? Yes. And also my, also my last. Because I'm going to die. Oh, so I guess you transferred in recently. You must be Jeremy, right? Everybody's been talking about you. I've heard all kinds of rumors. Apparently you fell off a cliff right after enrolling in the academy. And even picked a fight with Team Star. Yeah, I have a real death wish. Oh yeah, you started your treasure hunt thing, right? Come tell me about everything super interesting you find out there in your adventures. I'm kind of bored just sitting in here all day, you know? I don't have any classes t to teach. And students only come here to skip class. So yeah, drop by if you can. Deal? Deal. You become slightly, became slightly closer with Nurse Mir Miriam. Cool. I guess that's that then. Done then. No, there's still something to do in the nurse nurse's office. Probably tell her something about my adventures. Hey there, come on in. Everyone's welcome in the nurse's office. Hmm, Jeremy, have you toughened up a bit? Yes. Oh, so you know your tough stuff, huh? Haha, -ha, but seriously, you look a bit different. Ah, uh, that's crazy. How how do I look so d different? It's been five seconds. I, I, uh, ah, it's fine. I bet it's because of all the crazy experiences you're having on your treasure hunt. Yeah, that's the one. You need to tell me all about what you've been up to. Sure. So I walked to the door, and then I saw that you have something that you want to give me or something like that, and so I came back. Wow, that's super cool! I sure am jealous of you kids. You get to try out new things every single day. You, you telling me you don't walk to the door? Ever? Just... You, do you ever... Do you ever go, go out of this building? Uh, blink twice if you're okay. Oh no, she's not blinking. <laughs> Me, on the other hand, I actually wanted to become a teacher. I'm just the school nurse, you know. I can't teach classes or anything like that. I couldn't pass the certification exam to become an actual te health teacher. I, I, <laughs> I took it so many times, but no luck. So here I am, stuck forever in the nurse's office. That's very true. So, oh, uh, sorry. I guess this is- this isn't a very fun thing to talk about. But you're just... such a good listener. I find myself telling you kid- you all kinds of stuff. I hope you'll still come see me, even if I talk your ear off like this. Must be a sad life, being stuck in the nurse's office forever. Anyway, there's three more rooms to do, but I'm going to come back to those, I think, so I'm going to leave. Where's the leave button on the menu? There is none. But anyway, I need to probably go back to area one very quickly because there is something interesting that I found. And that is that there are Pokemon that you can find in area one that I have not caught yet. Ah, uh, but there's also other things that we can find there as well. So let's go... And fly away. Approach of the lighthouse, I don't know. I don't know what's closest to where I want to go. But I mean, the lighthouse is probably a good starting point. Because there's actually, uh, I think a TM behind it as well. That I didn't find the first time. Right back here. Also, you can really train your Pokemon up by just sending them out. It's crazy. Like, 
if you, all you do is just send them out, you can level up so fast. Especially if they are actually able... Like, if you're able to send out the weaker ones and they're actually able to... ...win the fight. But there's a chemical under the bridge that I didn't find the first time. I don't think. Maybe I did. But now... Let's go up the hill. Because I think... All the way up this way... Just need to keep an eye out on all the Pokemon because there, there definitely are some Pokemon that I have not seen out here that I can catch. But I'm gonna run from that for now. It's also actually interesting just to walk around on foot. Like sometimes. But I think on one of these rocks, not that one. Over here, there's, there's another Gimme Ghoul. Now, where else am I missing one? Or twelve, many. So many. Oh, I know. If we go down this path... I mean, there's probably more in this area that I haven't seen yet as well. But if we go... hang on. Thought that was a Pokémon. But if we go down here... All the way down to this sign... Right behind it is another Gimme Ghoul. I'm, I'm not sure if I got this last time or not, but I need to just get that, so... There are so many Gimme Ghoul. <laughs> like, so many. I think they respawn, though, so... I don't need to worry about getting some of them and not others. And if they do respawn, that'd be actually... A, this would probably be a good area to grind, probably. Maybe. I don't know if I want to grind for Gimme Ghoul coins, though. Not at this speed. There are much better ways to grind... ...than this. Ah, uh, but anyway, let's... ...possibly... ...teleport around again. Where do I want to go? I think I want to go... ...over here, possibly? Maybe? Because I think there might have been a few on this path that I didn't get last time. I might have... yeah, I don't know. I've just been too focused on doing... ...the main stuff that I'm working on... ...than looking at everything around me. Because there's one on this sign here... Go down a little bit more. Because somewhere down here, I think. I think that's one in there. Let's grab that one. Also, I'm going to send out a Pokemon just to get some XP. Uh, but also, going further into this area, I don't think there's one on this sign. I mean, there might be one on every sign, and I just haven't noticed. Every sign and every rock. I don't know. But all the way through here... All the way to this sign, there's another one. There are just so many that I've probably not seen. There's also a few other Pokemon in this area that I didn't find as well. That I probably should keep an eye out for as well, so... I think it depends on the time of day to whether or not I'll find them, so... Now, where is this thing? Up there. Okay. Let me also switch my, m my main Pokemon for the moment. I could actually probably... Hang on. Which button is it? I can't figure out the buttons anymore. I have, I have this problem all the time. Um, let me check the Pokemons. That one's really the only one that I could really send out. Other than my, my starter, probably. Which one's higher leveled? Oh, I guess it really doesn't matter. They're both, both pretty close in levels. Send you out. Now, how do I get up here? I mean, I could try something. Backwards jumping. Backwards jumping works really well, apparently. So that's cool, but I think this is dark type. I don't know what's effective against dark type. Uh, 
Ah, uh, dark type. <laughs> dark type, dark type, dark type. Maybe electric? I really have no idea. Definitely not fairy, and probably not psychic. Well, I've seen that Pokemon before, so I'm, I could just let it go, probably. Just gonna run, because I can. Just gonna take the LP with me. It's a Pokemon we've seen before. Just trying to see what it was. It's, it's, it's not the easiest thing to tell sometimes what a Pokemon is. Okay, I've seen Mew before. I'm looking out for blue things because that's the color of one of the Pokemon that we could find out here, possibly. But I'm unlikely to find it, so... I mean, there's a fair bit of this area that I didn't explore because of just how vast it is. Like, there's so much stuff. There's probably more trainers that we could fight as well. Is that a thing? Uh, the answer is no. But it is interesting. If I wander around, I probably will find what I'm looking for. Possibly. Hello. Just gonna send a... Pokemon to get you rid of you. And guess grab the item as well. Because that's the thing that I probably underuse is the Pokemon grabbing stuff for me. I see wind. Cool. Take that. I'm checking all the signs as well to make sure there's no gimmick that I'm missing. That's a lot of Pokemon. That's good, because then I can get all the XP. It takes, like, no time for them to go through battles. And just look at the XP go up, basically. Just need to not wander too far. And we get everything. I think that's just one of the other ones that we've seen before. Ah, hello. They do try to attack you, though. Well, for now... Let's battle. Couldn't agree more. R R Ryan? Ryan? The student. Well, this is a type of disadvantage. That's okay. We've got the levels and a slight advantage. Very slight. Oh, we won. We won. Cool. I still can't see how many more Pokemon there are. I still can't see Luxio. Okay. I guess we could keep going, but I kind of want to switch. Maybe? I mean, Barboach is very close to level 30, which is when he'll evolve, so... Although, I don't think I'm going to get enough XP from this battle to evolve him. Mud shot. It's super effective! Yeah, still not quite there yet. I think I'll actually switch Barboach into the lead. I lost! For now. See, I'll switch in Barboach to just grind a little bit because you can really just grind out any levels for evolving a Pokemon that you need just by sending them out. I'm also going to just walk around a bit because that's probably just going to be easier for doing so. I think this is... Oh, interesting. Oh, very interesting. Very, very interesting. What type, terror type are you? I'm pretty sure I caught you already. Poison type. Very beautiful poison type. Yeah, I've caught one of these already. Do I want a 
Poison Terror type. Not really. <laughs> I'll just take it down and get the XP from it. It's probably worthwhile. Poison Tail. Youch! It's not very effective, but I did get poison from it. That's a shame. Also, I don't think status effects matter when you're just playing in Let's Go mode, sending your Pokemon out to do their own thing, which is good. Well, there goes this thing. It was one HP away from breaking down. Ah, just like everyone in real life. Now, do I... I guess I could just catch it. I get XP either way, so... What is this typing normally? Just normal. Yeah, I think I don't care that much. There we go. Somebody's going to be upset by me not catching it. Possibly, I don't know. The one person who wants it. Like, specifically wants this specific Pokemon with its specific type. Got Charm. Did I grab the other item? Yes, the potion. It just didn't show up for a second and I was worried. Did I come go through here? Am I going around in circles? I'm going around in circles, it's fine. Now, how do I get up this way? Barbuck wore itself out. How dare you. How dare you. You've still got life. Unless you want me to change that. <laughs> oh, there's another item. Hang on, Barbuck. Go. Barbuck, go. Barbuck, bar bar you gonna really do this to me, Barbuck? Okay, fine. Grab. Rock Terrace Shard. Wow. Cool. Also, auto heal. How do I heal the status effect automatically? I, I don't think I can. Uh, antidote. We have 14 of them. We probably should use start using some status curing items. Just need to be careful which Pokemon I send them out against because some of these have the type advantage, but some of them don't, so... I like that I lock on to targets when I do that. They have a little, like they flash red and have an arrow point pointing to them. I think I've already caught one of you, haven't I? A Growlithe? Guess I could check my Pokedex. Ah, let's see. I don't even know where in the Pokedex it would be. It seems to change every time. Oh, so you can find... What's it called? An, a I think it's a dealing in... Area 1. It's a different kind. Maybe I didn't... Haven't found it. I thought I did. It's so hard to tell when some of these icons are changing. I'm pretty sure they're changing. Why? <laughs> this is upsetting to me. Why are they changing like this? I can't tell what anything is. Also, where? Maybe I haven't. Have I not? Maybe I haven't encountered one. Growlithe Intimidate. No, I've caught one. What? G game? It's fine. Everything's fine. Get that XP. Send you out, please. I don't know what's happening with the the sun right now, but something's happening. Let's grab some more stuff while we're here. Oh, there's another one of the Gimme Ghoul. Thank you for your coinage. 
There's another trainer as well. Guess I'll probably do the trainer first. I'm glad that I can auto heal by pressing minus on the that menu. Hey, guess who my favorite teacher at the academy is? Um, Nora the student. Um, love disc. Um, I have no idea. Mudshot. A speed fell, which is good for me. They use charm, which is not good for me, especially if it works. My attack actually fell. That's a shame. I love this to avoid the attack. Use charm again. Arg. Just gonna use water pulse, I guess. It's not very effective, is the problem. But it was a critical hit, so that's good. Nicely done. Pomo wants to learn Thunder Wave. Paralyzes the target. Nin 90 accuracy. That's pretty good. But also, I think I'm okay with just having my current thing. Once I get rid of Dig for that, I kind of like having Dig as the thing. Let's Mr. Jack. Okay. Cool. I don't know what that's trying to imply, but we got a low kick, so that's good. Oh, wow. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that train. Anyway, we've got Bulldoze. And it just reminded me a lot of Banjo-Kazooie. That little indent. Now, I think this is actually a dead end down here. So I should probably go somewhere else. Also, that thing is on the wall. Get him. Why? You can fly. Just go get him. <laughs> Why doesn't that work? I don't know. It feels like that should be able to happen, where they can just fly over to what they want to fight. But they never do, because they don't like going up cliff faces or... Um... Hang on. Go up. Up, 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 up. Hang on. They don't like going up cliff faces or over edges. They don't like going up hills, which is weird. Please, I'm so close. To giving up. <laughs> Please. Thank you. I'm glad that I've learned that trick. <laughs> it's so helpful being able to climb up things you're not supposed to be able to climb. Uh, anyway, let me send out my Pokemon a little bit more because he's almost leveled up. He can almost evolve. He's so close. Fight. Fight the Pokemon. Do it. Well, you're not fighting the Pokemon. Where, where are you going? Oh, there's plenty of Pokemon up here, though. I can basically just watch because he'll keep fighting stuff. I think. He should keep fighting stuff. Usually any Pokemon I send has been so aggressive, but n not right now, so. Level up. Probably just need to return him. Maybe? Did I do something wrong? Is it a certain type? This is it like, is it a certain thing that I've got done wrong? Probably. Might need to actually do an actual battle for it to evolve, maybe. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, I fought you before, right? 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 No. Yes. I've beat uh, Stantler before. Aquatail. Critical hit. That was a fair bit of XP from just that battle. What level was that? I don't even know. It might just be better to... ...fight ba the Pokémon in actual battles to get more XP faster. But it is nice being able to just send my Pokémon out, so... Can 
He still hasn't evolved. I'm concerned. Either I'm wrong, or the thing that I looked up is wrong. It's probably that one. Probably. I mean, it's probably both, but you know. It's fine. Oh, you've had- I, 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 I caught a green one, didn't I? I want to catch a pink one. Because I don't think I've caught a pink one yet. Also, this one's a small one, so I could probably just beat this one up. Not very effective. Takedown is the only thing that is effective. But it's also going to hurt Barboach, so... Which, I mean, is fine. Bullet Seed. Oh, that's going to be super effective, isn't it? In fact, everything's going to be super effective. <laughs> everything's going to be super effective. It's fine. Next Pokemon. Guess it doesn't matter what size this Pokemon is. Arm Thrust. One. A two. And a win. I wonder if Pokemon revive when I picnic. I think they do. Bite. Just to not overkill it, maybe. Thank you. Flinched and couldn't move. Perfect. Pokeball. One. Two. Oh, caught. Cool. Spring form. It says that under the types. So that way you can keep track of all the different variations. Take down. I also want to check out what this is. 